is why I, Brainy Smurf, humble servant of the masses, standing here before you in profound humility, my heart filled with the love you all owe to me for being the most intelligent Smurf in all the world. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Huh? Who's there? Better be important, that's all I can say, because... Ah, a monster! 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 Papa Smurf! Oh, Papa Smurf! There's a monster in the village! He's huge, fiery eyes, giant fangs, and he's covered with hair, and puffs like a dragon, and... Why, it's just a puppy! Well, hello there, my little friend. To what do we owe the pleasure of this? I'll save, baby! <laughs> As anyone can plainly see, Papa Smurf, this is obviously a harmless puppy. <laughs> well, Baby seems to have made the same observation. <laughs> Where'd the puppy come from? Who does it belong to? How did it get here? What difference does it make? It's here. Can we keep the puppy, Papa Smurf? Can we? Can we? Well, until I can... <laughs> Smurf? Yeah, let's open it! I think not, my little Smurfs. Best leave the locket alone until I can determine that it is safe to open. I'll bet there's a secret inside. Let's open it! If it says don't open it, it probably means uh, don't open it. Uh, what do you know? I say let's open it! Papa Smurf says curiosity kills the cat, and no matter how much I, Brainy Smurf, might personally like to open the locket... <laughs> Here you're having some trouble opening a little locket. <laughs> yeah. wow. No problem, no problem. Make way for my new automatic locket opener. Handy, handy, handy. Mechanical aptitude won't work here. We'll see about that. Ouch! Obviously, someone doesn't want that locket open. You can say that again. Ah, here it is. Omni One. Oh, my. The Smurflings are not going to like this. What is it, Papa Smurf? The puppy belongs to Omnibus. faster! <laughs> what are you going to tell them, Papa Smurf? We'll worry about that tomorrow. Right now, it's bedtime. Time for bed. <laughs> What's going on? What happened? Who's there? Just uh, checking on baby, my little Smurfs. <laughs> And there is no doubt about it, my little Smurfs. This dog does not belong to us. It belongs to Omnibus. And as much as I hate to tell you this, the dog must go home. Ah! Any volunteers? <laughs> I see. You, 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 and you. <laughs> Asriel, listen, there's a dog in the forest. <laughs> a good idea, Asriel. His bite may be worse than his bark. <laughs> what is it, puppy? There is no doubt in my mind, Smurfette. Puppy has treed a squirrel. 
<gasps> bucket. Can it be? Come along, Puppy. No time for games. No, oh, Puppy, leave the poor squirrel alone. Come on, come on, you smurfling. Lend a hand. <laughs> Tell you, Azriel, that dog is the legendary honey. I want that locket, Azriel. Come along. I mustn't let that dog out of my sight. Joe, these are the smurflings I've heard so much about. And Puppy, what are you doing back? Back? Uh, Papa Smurf says the dog belongs to you. Didn't Papa Smurf get my letter? This isn't fair. Not one bit. We like Puppy. Is there no justice in the world? But you don't have to return the dog. I meant for you to have it. You mean we can keep Puppy? Oh. Hey! Hey! Let's take Puppy home! Dear Papa Smurf, this puppy is a thousand years old, and within its locket is the key to all magic. The care of the puppy can only be entrusted to the pure of heart, and thus I send you this very special puppy. Love it. Guard it well. It must never fall into evil hands. Your dear friend, Omnibus. <coughs> Omnibus a visit, and for your sake, Gargamel, I hope you are not mistaken. Oh, no, no, oh, no, not at all. A puppy with an amulet. I, I saw it with my own eyes. Oh, you devils! Whoa! <laughs> Don't bother getting up, Gargamel. This won't take long. Yes? Where is it? It? The dog, man, the dog! Dog? What dog? Pray, what do you mean, kind sir? I don't need you, old man. I'll find the homely myself. Uh, Godfather, is there any way that I can... No, thanks. There's nothing you can do. Get out of my way. Don't just lie there, you idiot. Get up. Are you sure you don't mind this exploitation, puppy? Oh, come on, Nat. Have you ever seen a happier dog? <laughs> Ready? Get <laughs> <Yeah>, up, puppy. <laughs> Here, puppy, puppy, puppy! Here, puppy, puppy! Faster, puppy, faster! Smurflings, we'll get your puppy back. I'll be careful, Papa Smurf. Oh, I hope puppy's all right. Here, cut the collar off. Go ahead, cut it off. Ouch. Let's hope Balthasar has not gone to some ghastly extreme. <laughs> Forgive me, Godfather, but uh, don't you think this is carrying things a bit too far? Just get on with it. Quiet now. Let's hope we're not too late. What's that noise? Do you think it'll work, Papa Smurf? It's the only way. Let the blade fall! Must I? I said let it fall! Get out of here, puppy! They're heading for the tower! Faster, puppy! Faster! Jump! Here comes trouble! Don't miss! Don't miss! Shut up! Let's get out of here! See you back at the village!
we try, Snappy. Allow me. Here, puppy. Here, puppy, puppy, puppy. See? It's easy. Hey, that's no fair. You and Puppy have been practicing, haven't you? Gee, Snappy, I'll be glad to teach you how to call Puppy. Don't change the subject. Can I play with Puppy, too? <laughs> Here it is, Azriel, the means to the end of the Smurfs. The rare pick -a blue crystal from which I shall make a very special pair of goggles. Nana? I won't see anything but the color blue. I won't see bushes, trees, rocks, anything. <laughs> anything but little blue Smurfs. Keep your pesky paws away, you mangy cat. This crystal is very delicate. It must be handled with utmost... <laughs> My crystal! See what you've done, you miserable mongrel! I'm going to make you pay for this! I have just the spell for you, you little ankle biter! Ah, here it is! Clawed, scratched and bitten! Shoo, get down, scat! Puppy become kitten, dog become cat. <laughs> I've been dying to use that spell, but you see, I already have a cat. <laughs> <laughs> I love revenge. Come, Azriel. There's just enough peek -a blue crystal left in my quarry for one more try. Yeah, no doubt about it, Papa Snuff. This could be our finest crop of snuff that he's ever... <laughs> that was a loaded raffle. Every Smurf is working day and night. The seedlings must take root before the rainy season or be washed away. Don't be worrying, Papa Snuff. We'll be done in plenty of time. <sighs> Why don't you go home and get some rest, Papa Smurf? It's time for baby's nap anyway. <laughs> Only a frightened field mouse, baby. <gasps> Asriel! <laughs> Why, it, it, it's Puffy! <laughs> At least I think it's Puppy. Amazing! Puppy thinks he's a kitten. Perhaps it's a spell. I must get the poor dog to my lab. Now, let me see. There must be some way to break that kitty spell. Hmm. I'll try this. Catnip and furball, chase ball of yarn. Claw up the curtains, kitty be gone! Great Smurfs! That spell Puppy is under is stronger than I thought. Powers of magic, please hear my yell. I made a boo-boo. Ignore that last spell. <laughs> Phew. Before I try anything else, I think I'll consult with Omnibus. Poor Puppy will have to remain a cat for a very long time. Your friend, Papa Smurf. Here you are, Smurfberry Bird. Take this to Omnibus as fast as you can. <laughs> Oh, well, at least my message will get there fast. Come in. Uh, oh, well, my, my little Smurflings. <laughs> Papa Smurf, have you seen Puppy? He's been gone a long time. We're very worried. Why, Puppy's probably just off in the forest chasing a bird. A uh, uh, bunny. Can we go look for him, Papa Smurf? Well, uh, uh, I'm very sorry, but uh, you Smurflings mustn't go into the forest by yourselves. We know, Papa Smurf. We can't go anywhere without a grown-up. Too bad all the grown-up Smurfs are busy planting seedlings. What about you, Papa Smurf? You can take us. Oh, uh, yes, I uh, I forgot about me. I, um, I'd be happy to take you. Yay! But I'm very, very tired. I really need some rest. Aww. Don't worry, my little Smurflings. Dogs and uh, <coughs> cats are quite at home in the woods. All right, Papa Smurf. Bye, Papa Smurf. Goodbye, my little Smurflings. Hmm. 
before I go after Poppy, I'd better wait for a reply from Homnibus. But you heard what Papa Smurf said. And I said we can't wait. Poppy might be in trouble. Let's go right now. No one will see us. Come on. Prance and Puppy Snappy, we can't do that. We'd be in more trouble than Puppy. Then what can we do? We can convince Papa Smurf to let us go along. Are you with us, Slouchy? No, I'm over here. The last of the peak of blue crystal, Azriel. First, I must cut it down to fit my goggles. I can't wait to see the Smurfs, no matter where they're hiding. <laughs> <laughs> Papa Smurf really was tired. He didn't even hear us knocking. Let's wake him up. I could accidentally make a lot of noise. Hi, Smurf Paper. Bye, Smurf Paper. Oh, what is it, Old It's a message for Papa Smurf from Homnibus. If it's important enough, we just might have to wake up Papa Smurf. What's it say? What's it say? Sorry to hear about your problem, Papa Smurf. It's a very serious condition. <gasps> Your only hope is to follow this prescription immediately. What's a prescription? I think it's something you get when you're sick. Chatter and chipmunks, Papa Smurf's sick. Gee, and he told us he was just tired. Isn't that just like Papa Smurf? He didn't want anyone to worry. We better get the other Smurfs. The prescription says immediately. That's right now. We gotta help Papa Smurf now. <coughs> You're right, Snappy. Listen to this. Step one, a gentle brushing out while the victim is sleeping. Gosh, we better get started before he wakes up. Complete the rest of the steps as fast as you can. Bark in each ear, douse with itchy water to encourage scratching. Wash thoroughly, and last, if nose is warm, do the chant on the back of this note, but only while holding a dogwood branch. Dogwood branch? Slouchy, you start brushing Papa Smurf's beard while the rest of us get what we need. Hmm, I wonder how many hairs Papa Smurf has in his beard. One, two, three, four, five, two thousand seven, two thousand... We have everything we need. Hurry up, Smurflings, hurry! <laughs> Taking a bath is all right, I guess, if you don't have to take it too far. Now remember, Slouchy, after we bark, we got to finish the prescription as fast as we can. Now! <laughs> now, Nat! <laughs> Itchy water! Don't worry, Papa Smurf. We have everything under control. What do you smurflings think you're doing? We know all about your illness, Papa Smurf. My, uh, illness? <gasps> His nose is warm! Get the dogwood branches! Nose warm? Dogwood branches? Here goes! Salt and pepper, slime and mold. Salt and... and... <laughs> Change this nose from warm to cold! Yes! <laughs> <gasps> Something tells me we're doing something wrong. All right, Smurflings, that's enough. I want to know exactly what is going on. Poor Puppy. I wonder where he could be. Hmm, it's amazing, but... I'm certain Puppy is in this direction. It's Puppy! <laughs> Just a little tap. And my new peak of blue goggles will enable me to see nothing but little blue smurfs everywhere I look. <laughs> it works! I can't see a thing! Now, where are those miserable blue creatures? Ah! Nothing but a bluebird! <gasps> there they are! And not far away either. <laughs> come, come, Asriel. I can taste those Smurfs already. Oh, oh Smurfs. <laughs> Smurfs, Smurfs. All right, my little Smurflings. This last chance should do it. Salt and pepper, slime and mold. Turn this nose from warm to cold. <laughs> 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 
Smells fine to me. Papa Smurf, Puppy's glowing. Hold those dogwood branches tightly, or you might catch the smell. I, I see birdies, Asriel. <laughs> Don't you see them? Why, they're flying all about my head eh, with those little stars. <laughs> We're sorry we did all those things to you, Papa Smurf. Well, <laughs> you were just trying to help. The important thing is to remember that little Smurflings should leave prescriptions alone, whether medical or magical. Yeah, uh, well, well, Papa Smurf. They can be dangerous, all right. Hmm. I wonder. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, kitty, kitty, kitty. Cottage cheese, your favorite. You're all one grateful wretch. Star for all I care, you stupid furball. supposed to feed Puppy. I think I am, but I don't want to miss dessert. You feed him. It's your turn. <laughs> later, Puppy, later. Handy Smurf, what are you doing this time of night? He's working on a new invention, Papa Smurf. At this time of night? Handy, what are you doing? It's a secret! And a very important secret, I'm sure, Handy. But can't it wait until morning? Sorry, Papa Smurf. <laughs> I, Handy Smurf, am proud to present my Smurfiest invention. After all this hoopla, this better be good. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> It looks very interesting, Handy, but what is it for? Watch! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> what do you call it, Handy? What do you call it? I call it the stringling. The stringling? Why not? Gotta call it something. Handy must be the greatest inventor in the whole wide world. Ooh, can I have a stringling for my own? Me too. Me too. Please, please, Handy, please. I'll make one. Not now, Puppy. Can't you see I'm busy? Uh, no, 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 Clumsy. You must impart a Smurf difficult force so that the Smurfibrium is proportional to the twist of your wrist. Observe. Ouch! Gosh, Brainy, I wish I could do that. You can, Clumsy. You can. Smurf be alone, Puppy. If I am pestered by a dog, how can I ever master the complicated principles of the stringling? I hate the stringling. It be two days now, Papa Smurf, and I can't get any Smurfs to help me with work. The stringling business has gone too far. Now, now, Farmer Smurf, be patient. Smurf my words, Papa Smurf. Will wish Handy never started this stringling nonsense. You know these fads here today, gone tomorrow. <laughs> Don't be a pest, puppy. Can't you see I'm trying to practice my stringling? Not now, puppy. Later. Go away, puppy. <laughs> Visitors? It's just a hungry puppy, Azriel. <laughs> Azriel, that's not any puppy, that's the puppy. Here, puppy, puppy, puppy. Here, puppy, here, puppy. Come to Gargamel. Here, puppy, puppy, puppy. Hungry? Come along, poor puppy. Here, nice little puppy. I have something yummy for you. Here, stupid puppy, have some din-din. 
<laughs> the secrets to all magic will soon be mine. Mine! Mine! <laughs> you know, Lazy, I've smurfed this string -a -ling long enough. I'm getting back into me. That is right. I'm getting back into <sighs> sleep. <laughs> well, you were right, Papa Smurf. There's a season for everything. <laughs> and string -a -ling season is just about over. Oh, I'm bored. Me too. What do we do? Anybody seen Puppy? Not me. Not me either. I haven't seen him since the day before yesterday. Well, let's go find him. We'll play fetch. Yeah. Here, Puppy. Here, Puppy. Here, Puppy. Just look at it, Azriel. Just look at it. Right now? The locket, you idiot. Inside that locket is the secret to all magic, infinite power, infinite wealth. Here, Puppy. Nice Puppy, Puppy. Do I dare? Why not? Who's to stop me? Yikes! <laughs> you, you selfish beast! I should let you starve, starve, starve! Oh, starvation! What a lovely idea! I'll let you starve, you worthless mutt! Then, <laughs> the collar will simply fall off your scrawny neck! Hmm, this is most fascinating. I must perform another experiment. We found his dish. Can't find Puppy. But who fed him today? What about yesterday? Well, he... It wasn't my day. I wasn't supposed to. Neither was I. When was Puppy fed last? It was before we started playing with the Stringerlings, Papa Smurf. Oh, dear. That was four days ago. I told you so, Papa Smurf. Maybe it's all my fault for smurfing this. Now, my little Smurfs, I think we all neglected Puppy. The important thing is to find him. Puppy is not a wild animal. He must be starving by now. Nobody loves animals more than I do, but if I can't starve that locket off your bones, I'm going to get it one way or another. When it's all over, I'll pick the collar and locket out of the ashes. <laughs> Not hot enough. More firewood. We've got to get rid of Azriel. Free puppy and escape. We could climb down the string. You still have that stupid thing? Well, actually, I forgot to throw mine away, too. I can't believe, after all this trouble, that any Smurf... Yeah, what's that sticking out of your pocket? Okay. But how do we get rid of Azriel? Now I'll roast all of you. Every single last one of you. <laughs> Thank you, my friend. Thanks, Smith. 
darkness that Puppy and the Smurflings are home safe and sound. Hooray! And Papa Smurf, we Smurflings promise that we'll never neglect Puppy ever again. Hooray! I am sure you won't, my little Smurflings. Puppy isn't just a Smurfy toy. No, Nat, he isn't. He's a living creature with feelings just like us. That's right, Nat. And we must take good care of Puppy and our whole Smurfy. Papa Smurf, Papa Smurf. Yes, Brainy, what is it? It's Puppy. He's acting very strange. Look. <laughs> I think Puppy has been stuffed with too many treats. It isn't healthy to overfeed a dog, is it, Papa Smurf? No, it isn't, Brainy. But I think this one time, he'll be all right. What do you say, Puppy? <laughs> would be the perfect pattern. It matches my eyes. Oh! Oh, you naughty puppy! You've ruined my ambiance! Not to mention my wallpaper. Go away! I'm back with the books I borrowed. Careful, Brainy. This is a very delicate experiment. One false move could smurf me sky high. Say no more, Papa Smurf. I'll be extra careful. Oh. Now, how may I assist you? Uh, why don't you just wait outside and uh, see that I'm not disturbed? Puppy! Puppy, stop that digging! This is a restricted area! Uh-oh! Puppy's digging up Papa's mercy yard! Puppy, I insist you desist from digging at once! <laughs> I told Puppy to stop digging. It wasn't our fault. We just told Puppy to fetch the bone. I'm afraid this dog is totally lacking in discipline. Gosh, Papa Smurf. Puppy's good most of the time, and he listens to me when I tell him to. Oh, stay, Puppy, stay! <laughs> Mm, I see what you mean, Nat. Your control over Puppy is absolutely smurfly astounding. Mark my words, Papa Smurf. Until Puppy gets some training, he'll continue to be a menace to society. Stay, Puppy. Come back, Puppy. Before you get into more trouble. <laughs> Lazy, we still need a few more logs. Gosh, that was close. Yeah, thanks, Andy. Galloping gazelles, we're never gonna catch puppy. That puppy should be on a leash. Yum. Mm. Smurfberry truffles are my favorite. Mind if I have one? Mm. No, 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 no. I certainly do. They're my favorite, too. Papa, big horns, look out! Smurfaroo, we tried to warn you. That rabbit made puppy run wild. <laughs> Yuck. Keep away from my truffles. Oh, this dog is a hog. I'm telling Papa Smurf! This dog almost flattened three Smurfs! Gobbled three dozen truffles! And upset me so much that I'm getting a stress wrinkle. Yeah! I agree, my little Smurfs. Something must be done about Puppy. Either he learns to obey, or he must be tied up outside the village. Lots of lions! I know. The four of us can teach Puppy to be well behaved. Hmm. Well, I suppose it's worth a try. Come on, puppy. Come to Nat. No walking, no cooking. <laughs> hey, no fear, puppy. You gotta earn your reward. Having problems? I strongly recommend using my book, Canine Training Tips. <clears throat> Lesson one. Thanks, puppy. <laughs> to steal life with Melon Field. <laughs>
the runs are still liable. I hope Bubby hasn't gotten into any more trouble. It was that horrible hound, Papa Smurf. Uh-oh, too late. That poopy punk showed the portrait and turned the farmer's melons into squash. Hmm, sounds to me like Puppy is flunking his training. Oh, please give me another chance, Bobby. He'll get better, you'll see. Well, there's plenty of room for improvement. Jump, Puppy, jump! Those simpering sounds can mean only one thing, Azriel. Smurfs. Jumpies, Puppy. Jump in Oh, we jump for a cookie? <laughs> but will he jump without a cookie? Smurferoo, all we're gonna end up with is a plump puppy. Maybe we ought to try teaching him to fetch again. Yeah, fetch the bone, Puppy, and bring it back to me. <laughs> So, a miserable hound likes to bury things in the village, eh? My, my, that gives me food for thought, Azriel. <coughs> Wait, why bother with a few pint-sized Smurfs when we can have the whole village? <coughs> Quickly, we must get back to the hovel. <coughs> There's work to be done. Eager eagles, I can hardly wait to show these Smurfs what puppies learn. I hope he's learned a better way to play fetch. I'm getting tired of filling in these holes. Every Smurf watch! Roll over, puppy! Hey, puppy, stay. To lose the track, the beast is running a <laughs> Papa Smurf, it's back to school for Puppy. And this time, use my new book, No More Bad Puppies, the Brainy Smurf Way. <laughs> Nothing is too good for the Smurfling's four-footed friend. Add a dram of directional dust. <laughs> Azriel, it's working! Now, this magic homing rod will lead us straight to the magic bone. And when that puppy brings it to Smurf Village, we'll be right behind. <laughs> Let's try it again, puppy. Now, roll over. Stay. Stay. Well, that's one way to get him to stay. But I guess we still owe him a cookie. Soon I'll be filling my sack with swarms of Smurfs. Yes, this kettle will hold a hundred Smurfs quite nicely. <laughs> and I'll finally get to use this serving platter Mummy gave me. That slobbering Smurf puppy must have taken the bait. <laughs> Our bone is on the move! Smurferoo, I guess we're far enough from the village to risk throwing Puppy's bone. And maybe this time Puppy won't want to run all the way home to bury it. Or maybe he'll fetch it back to us like he's supposed to. Fetch, Puppy, fetch. <laughs> <laughs> Worried warthogs, is he going to bring it back to us? Uh-oh, sounds like he's still up to his old tricks. <laughs> faster, Osriel! Faster! That hairy hound's really on the move. But he's obviously taking the long way home. Yeah! Oh, watch out! Out of those splinters! Oh. Yow! Thanks for the help, Brainy. The lab is spotless. Oh, don't mention it, Papa Smurf. As I always say, cleanliness is next to Smurfiness, eh? Stop, Puppy, stop! Oh, we're sorry, Papa Smurf. Who am I, Snouty? But Puppy must stay out of this village from now on. <laughs> oh, please, Papa Smurf, just give us one more chance. Papa Smurf is right. There is no evidence that Puppy has learned anything. Probably because you didn't use my book. Surprise! Here's Gargamel! <laughs> Every 
Hungry Dog has his day, Slurps. And thanks to your puppy, I'm having mine. <laughs> I'm so glad you could make it for dinner, Smurfs. Now, what should I make, Azriel? Smurfs too, or Smurf Kebab? Meow. Both? Well, why not? I've got enough Smurfs. <laughs> Steak flambe, we are the André, Papa Smurf. Don't worry, my little Smurfs. I'll think of something, I hope. <laughs> A little salt? Some oil? <laughs> you won't get away with this, you mean nasty wizard! <laughs> And who's going to stop me? <laughs> yes, Azriel, we do need more wood. We don't want our Smurfs too rare. <laughs> Papa Smurf, I'm too young to be a main course. Papa Smurf, it's Puppy. He'll help us escape. I only wish he could, Nat. I know he can. Puppy, jumpy. Now, roll over. How was that supposed to accomplish? I thought it might Smurf open the cage. There's still a chance if Puppy can fetch the key. You heard him, Puppy. Fetch the key. smurf a room. Way to go, Puppy. Good boy. Ready for Dindin, my little blue beauty? <laughs> oh, why, you clumsy cat! <laughs> Smurfs, I hate pets, and most of all, I hate that cowardly cat, Azriel. Congratulations, Smurflings. You taught Puppy so well, he saved us from Gargamel. Good job, Puppy. And to show our thanks, here's... A portrait of the puppy and his trainers. Yeah. And a brand new home. <laughs> Good to be You're welcome. Well, Papa Smurf, you might at least mention that it was my book, No More Bad Puppies, that was responsible for turning this disobedient dog into... Hey! Huh, this village is really going to the dogs. Yuck. to me, Brainy Smurf, friend to all the animals, that puppy is simply bored. What he needs is a challenge. <laughs> That's it. You're getting as bad as clumsy. Sorry, Brainy. I guess I over-smurfed that. Say, what's wrong, little snapper? You look like you've lost your best Smurf. Ah, uh, puppy's a party pooper. He just doesn't want to play. Fiddle Smurfs, what this old dog needs is some Smurfy new tricks. <laughs> and I have just what he needs, a Smurferang. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Works every time. Smurferoo, let's go get it! Just follow in my footsteps, Kruppel, and maybe you'll learn a thing or two. Like finding out what we're doing here? We're getting closer to the Great Oak, Lame Brain. The Smurfs are always passing by here. <coughs> now move out. The coast is clear. <coughs> I got him! Careful, you fool! Hey, what's so special about those crummy old eggs anyway? These are magic gems which have been handed down from wizard to wizard for many generations. Uh, 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 at least that's what it said in the wizard's catalog. Deal. With these ectoplasmic eggs, I will become the leader of the Smurfs, and then I'll lead those little blue yummies right into my stew pot. <laughs> <laughs> Rudy, I've 
I've never seen an egg like this before. I'll bet Kathy Smurf would want to look at that. Good idea, Sassy. <laughs> Go quickly to Papa Smurf, you little blue twitsy. <laughs> I don't believe it. You just let those Smurfs slip through your fingers. You must be getting soft-hearted in your old age, Goggy. Soft-hearted? Me? Why should I settle for a few appetizers when I can have the whole hundred-course meal? <laughs> Oh, such beauty. It's all so breathtaking. Uh, Vanity, may I take a look at that crystal now? You've been staring at it for hours. With a face like mine, can you blame me? <laughs> the trouble with teaching puppy new games is he doesn't want to stop playing them. <laughs> Soon all the Smurfs will be mine. Thanks to my wonderful magic egg, I will easily switch bodies with Papa Smurf. Oh, ouch, ow! Oh, Gordy gets all the Smurfs. What do I get? Oh, a backache. Scruple, stop playing around. Make sure you lock me up good and tight. Ah, you should have been locked up long ago. Now let me see. The other egg should have fallen into Papa Smurf's hands by now. Yes, yes, he's got it. Now to complete the spell. <laughs> Great Smurfs, something is happening. Egg that shows another face. Now you put me in his place. Uh, it's working, Scrooper. The spell is working. Yeah, yeah, I heard that before. Amazing, simply amazing. <laughs> the switch is taking place. Papa Smurf will soon be trapped in my body, and I'll be in his. <gasps> oh, no! <laughs> That's not Papa Smurf! <laughs> to be more careful. I'd better take this gem to my lab for further study. And make sure that Puppy stays out of trouble, my little Smurflings. No problem, Papa Smurf. Ooh, I may not be Papa Smurf, but if I play nice doggy for a little while, I can round up all the Smurfs one by one for a big blue barbecue. <laughs> <laughs> Gee, I've always wanted a dog, so I could run him ragged. Come on, Goggy, let's go play a game of fetch through the swamp. <laughs>
what this smut needs is something to get him moving. Oh, Asriel! Gargamel's looking for you! This may be a dog's life, but I am going to get some Smurfs while I'm here. And that tasty-looking morsel will be the first one! <laughs> hey, puppy! Do you have a nice nap? <laughs> ruff, 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 ruff. Are you hungry? Oh, ruff, 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 ruff. <laughs> I guess we're playing a new game, huh, puppy? <laughs> this is fun, puppy! But, uh, how do I get out? <laughs> you don't. <laughs> but there's no need to worry. Soon you'll have plenty of company. <laughs> Golly! Puppy's not only acting funny, he's talking funny. Talking? Hey, what are you doing? Help on around! Help on around! Help on around! This isn't one of the tricks I taught, Puppy. <laughs> What's the matter, you little blue baboons? Feeling down in the dumps? <gasps> <laughs> Dig in, you old mutt. <laughs> this isn't going to be as easy as I thought. There's absolutely no mention of a crystal egg in any of these books. <laughs> What's all the commotion about? <gasps> Where is every smurf? <laughs> Puppy, have you seen my little Smurfs? Can you show me where they are? <laughs> I'll take you there in person. Gargamel in the flesh. Uh, I mean fur. I knew you'd fall for my brilliant scheme, Papa Smurf. No Smurf could ever resist my glorious magic egg. You won't get away from me this time. Eat every last scrap. What is this stuff? Sauteed slime pond scraps. You've eaten two bowls of it already. <laughs> He gave you the boot instead. <laughs> Quiet, you tacky tag along. One of these days, I'll get even with that Balthazar. And it'll probably be the last thing he ever does. <laughs> what 
a smurfic day for a picnic, my little Smurfs. Every Smurf who's any Smurf will want to taste my spicy succotash stew. Really, Greedy, these picnics are supposed to be heartwarming, not heartburning. If you ask me, no Smurf will want to taste that concoction. Smart for me, Gora. Greedy scrumptious stew must be ready. I could smell it from 50 feet under. My new recipe will make you flip Smurf over heels, Miner. <laughs> well, light my lantern. I see what you mean, Greedy. That stew was so good, I can't wait to try my new sarsaparilla punch. Catch the ball, puppy. simmering in my stew pot. Huh? It's the Smurf's puppy. Grab him, Scruple. When the Smurfs come looking for that howling hound, we'll be here to greet them. Yow! That foaming Fido has flipped its fur. Man puppy! Man puppy! That canine won't get another taste of me! Ouch! There he is. I wonder what the Smurfs want with that dog. Don't worry, puppy. You'll feel Smurfier in no time. Nice going, Brainy. You backed puppy into a thorn bush. <laughs> if puppy was tougher, he wouldn't have these problems. Boy, let's go back to the village and get you cleaned up. And then I have an idea how to turn Puppy into a real dog. So there was nothing wrong with that dog after all. This may just be the break I need to have some fun with Gargi. <laughs> Fomus labyrinthus. It says here that Fomus labyrinthus is caused by the bite of a drooling puppy. You're gonna turn into a mutt by midnight, Gargi. Nonsense, you nitwit. Let me see that book. Uh, er, sure, Gargi. I can't read this. It's it's all a blur. Uh-oh, that's the first symptom, Gargi. Your sight begins to go. Ouch! Maybe I'm just tired. A nice nap should bring things back into focus. <laughs> Pickle the fuel. <laughs> This ought to convince Garney that he's going to the dogs, and then his hobble will go to me. What are you doing, you imbecile? Well, I was just uh, noticing how healthy and shiny your hair looks. See for yourself, Gargi. He gets my hair is healthy and shiny, but it's all over my body. What will all the wizards say when they see me like this? How about here, boy? Oh, what a tragedy! So many uncast spells, so many uncaught smurfs! What do I do now? Put your paw print, I mean sign right here! But, well, what's this? It's your will, Gargi. You don't want this stump, uh, I mean, I mean this hobble to fall uh, into the wrong hands, do you? Ah, 
If I'm turning into a dog, I'll go down barking. After all, I don't care what happens to me anymore. What do you mean, Gargi? First, I'm going to get that sense of crown from Balthazar, and then I'm going to catch those miserable Smurfs once and for all. What did you say to me? I said I've taken enough of your guff, you old windbag, and now I'm going to take this hat for myself. Give that back! What's gotten into you, you new? Quiet, you hot-headed has-been! I'm barking the orders now! Come on, Scruple, we've got Smurf to catch. Gosh, I've never seen them like this, Gargi. So forceful, so dominant, so stupid. I'll teach that peasant to show some respect to his elders. We're hot on the trail of those Smurfs now, Zerubo. Ouch! You're not kidding, Gargi! Just stick close behind me, Zerubo. Is this close enough, Gargi? Quiet, Zerubo. I've got Smurfs in my sights. I knew this hat would be their downfall. No! There they are now, Scoople. But that crazed canine is with them. Oh, this is no time to roll over and play dead, Gargi. Get out there and face him mutt to mutt. You're right, Scoople. I'm a bigger dog than he is. <laughs> How do you expect to scare anyone with that growl, puppy? <laughs> now that's much better. Why, thank you! <laughs> You'd better run, because my bite is definitely worse than my bark! <laughs> Wait, Puppy, you're supposed to be protecting us! Ah, that pesky pooch is no match for me! in no time. Hey! Forget that sense of flop, Gargi. The Smurfs are right over there. Look, Scrooper. They've got former slobberitis, too. Wait a minute. It's that foamy punch they're drinking. I'm not going to turn into a dog after all. Doggone it. There goes my hovel. I've got my whole life ahead of me. And I think I'll celebrate by catching Smurf! <laughs> Smurf, my shillelies! Even ants couldn't spoil this picnic! What about Uncle Gargi? <laughs> Gargi! I got you this time, you little pests! Maybe 
a touch too much sarsaparilla. You can't pull the fur over my eyes anymore, Scruple. I'm not signing this worthless will. When I get my hands on you, you'll need a will of your own. But, but, but Gorgi, aren't you glad to be alive? I'll make you wish you were never born. <laughs> Now I'm really in the doghouse. Smurf, Nabbit, it's hotter than a dragon's breath today. Oh, you can say that again. I would if my mouth wasn't so dry. Oh, why did I volunteer to come on this forsaken expedition? You didn't volunteer. Yeah, Papa Smurf said it was your turn to help gather the summer roots. We're about to smurf of thirst, and they're nitpicking. <laughs> Out the puppy smells water. Hey, hey wait, wait for, for us. us! Puppy, smurf away from that pond. <laughs> water! Out of my way! Stop, you thirst-crazed maniac! Okay, okay, you can go first. Smurf back, all of you. I've seen water like this before. What's wrong with it, Grandpa? This water's tainted. <gasps> tainted? Hey, where's Puppy? Here, yeah. Puppy. <laughs> It looks like Poppy's been poisoned by the tainted water. Oh, dear. What are we going to do, Grandpa? We need some of this water to show Papa Smurf. Matt, you stay with Poppy while we smurf back to the village to get Papa Smurf. Don't worry, Poppy. You'll be okay. Oh, 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 oh dear. I wish Papa Smurf would hurry. Oh, yeah. The situation is much worse than I feared. I'm afraid unless the tainted pond is purified by the horn of a magic unicorn, Puppy will die. Die? A unicorn? But Papa Smurf, unicorns are just fairy tale horses. Papa Smurf, unicorns are the most noble, magical creatures in the forest. Grandpa's correct. It's right here in my book of mystical creatures. A unicorn's horn can purify anything it touches. Through the ages, kings and wizards have hunted the unicorn to use this great magical power. Why, it wasn't more than 200 years ago. I saw a unicorn in the land of mists. Do you think that you could find the unicorn again, Grandpa? Smurf or Rudy, I sure do. I told you to bring me misty root rot, you troublesome twit. But Gorgi! Yay! This is regular root rot. Hey, you! How can you tell the difference? Misty root rot is lighter, more aromatic. Well, if you say so, Gargi. I do, so don't come back without it. I think his brain's turned to root rot. One of these days, I'm going to get even with that creep. <coughs> okay, oh, come on. Get <laughs> Smurf out of the way! Okay, Papa Smurf, I'm ready. Go away, Handy. Good work, Handy. I sure hope Grandpa finds the unicorn in time, Papa Smurf. So do I, Nat. So do I. Oh, why did I volunteer to come on this forsaken expedition? You didn't. Papa Smurf made you come with us to look for the unicorn. Uh, is it much farther, Grandpa? I'm not sure, Smurfette, but I'll be able to see better from up here. Well, if you ask me, there's no such thing as a magic unicorn. And what'd you call that? An overgrown goat? Oh, he's absolutely beautiful. Since wizards are always hunting them, unicorns are mighty skittish about leaving their forest. We don't want to frighten him. Uh, Grandpa, may I talk to him? Well, all right. But be careful. Uh, hello, Mr. Unicorn. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to startle you, but we need your help. 
Smurfer Rudy, that was close. I sure hope Smurfette can convince the unicorn to help us. So you see, Mr. Unicorn, if you won't help us purify the tainted pond, Puppy will die. Oh, please, you've just got to help us. <laughs> Don't cry, Smurfette. Yeah, maybe we can find a unicorn with a heart. Yay! Are you saying you will help us? Oh, thank you, thank you! Yeah, thanks a lot. Yuck! Ugh! Ugh! Lucky for Puppy, we didn't listen to Brainy. Or we never found the unicorn. Whoa! Unicorn? What you don't seem to understand, Smurfette, is that for a brilliant mind such as mine, seeing is believing. Then watch this! Yay! Oh no! Scruple's got the unicorn! <laughs> Looks more like the unicorn's got Scruple. No! Whoa! No! One. Okay, Hornhead, now that you know who's boss, yay! <laughs> yay! Smart for Rudy, we could sure use you on our Smurfball team. Honest, Gargi, I dropped the root rot when I jumped on the unicorn. Unicorn, my foot. Yay! But it's true, Gargi, I really did ride a unicorn. Stop horsing around and bring me my root rot. Boy, what a drag. For once, I tell Gargi the truth, and what does it get me? More work. <laughs> so Gargi doesn't believe me, eh? Uh, is Puppy's fever down yet, Papa Smurf? <laughs> I'm afraid his fever is rising. Clumsy, I want you to Smurf back to the village for more towels. Uh, sure thing, Papa Smurf. <laughs> one white nag, one horn, and a dab of glue. Ta-da! One not-so-magical unicorn. <coughs> Come on, giddy-up! Uh-oh, that sounds like Scrooge. <laughs> I'm gonna teach old gullible Gargi a lesson in horse sense. Oh, gosh! Scruple's captured the magic unicorn! I better tell Papa Smurf right away! <laughs> and then I think I'll have Scruple scrub out all of my beakers. Twice. Won't Scruple be surprised when he sees this list of jaws? Not as surprised as you're gonna be! He gads a magic unicorn! My magic unicorn, but I might share him with you if you start being nice to me. Oh, you sweet, wonderful boy. How could I have ever doubted you? <clears throat> Clumsy, are you absolutely sure you saw Scrooge with a unicorn? Uh, well, it had a big horn right here. <clears throat> look, those hoof prints lead right into the hovel. I think we'd better take a look inside. A unicorn's horn contains all its magical powers. <laughs> Boy, what a jump. I command you to bring me some Smurfs. Great Smurfs. Uh, look, Handy. Oh, no. Whoa! <laughs> huh? But it can't be. Oh, no! <laughs> the unicorn giveth and Goggy taketh away. <laughs> I hope Papa Smurf and the others get back soon. Oh, oh, Smurf and Rudy, it looks like we made it just in time. One dip of your magic horn should smurf it. Yeah, Papa Smurf and the others went to the hovel to rescue it. Great. 
night, Smurfs in the morning. We'd better hightail it to the hobo. Make sure puppy gets plenty of water. Hit up, big fella. Whoa! Hmm, I wonder if magic unicorns like diced Smurf Supreme. This can't be happening. Uh oh, but this can. Rub my unicorn's horn and wish that other one away. <laughs> Yay! Yay! Oh. Hurry, Grandpa! Oh. Hold your horses, I'm coming. Oh, ouch. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, clumsy. <laughs> Let's smurf out of here. I hate those miserable Smurfs. <laughs> Hold still or you're glue. Whoa! Uh-oh, the party's over. Scrooper. Oh, I'll get you for this, you bonehead. <laughs> We want to give you an extra Smurfy thank you for making Puppy well. <laughs> I think Puppy's trying to say thank you too. Goodbye. <laughs>